The Haunting of Hill House was and still remains my favourite show on Netflix. The 10 episode masterpiece perfectly encapsulated a horrifying ghost story that didn't need to rely on jump scares or cheap tricks to fool the audience and at its heart it possessed a personal tale about family. To me the first season felt perfect to the point that I wasn't even sure if it needed a second one but for better or worse, Netflix have announced that there will indeed be a follow up in 2020 called The Haunting of Bly Manor. Throughout this video I'll be discussing all of the details that we know so far about the show and the meaning behind its title. There will be spoilers here so if you don't want to know anything about the show so far or where it could go then I highly suggest that you turn off now. With that out the way, I'm Definition and here's my breakdown of everything that you need to know about The Haunting of Bly Manor. From the title, I think it's pretty safe to say that the original cast of season 1 will not be returning. Bly Manor did not feature in their backstory, so they would have none of the emotional ties that were so prevalent in the first season. I also feel like their journey wrapped up so perfectly with the father's sacrifice that it would be a waste to pull them back into it, especially with the deal that he made with the house to save his family. Instead the show will likely follow a brand new cast of characters who may or may not already be aware of the family from the first season. But where does the name Bly Manor come from and what can we take from this? Well Bly Manor is taken from an 1898 novel called The Turn of the Screw. In that book a governess and the two children that she cares for live in a country house and slowly uncover the more sinister side to it. If that sounds familiar then you'll be pleased to know that the novel was reportedly the inspiration behind the Nicole Kidman film The Others. Similar to the first season, The Turn of the Screw deals heavily with mental health and over the years many fans and critics of the novel have debated over whether the ghosts in the story actually exist or if they are merely figments of the governess's imagination. So when will it be set? Well personally I believe that though the novel is set in the past, the Netflix adaptation will take place in modern day to avoid comparisons to the others and to stick more in line with the original season. The Haunting of Bly Manor is set to be released in 2020 so stay tuned to the channel for more updates as they come out. Obviously I'd love to hear your thoughts on the news of the second season and if you're excited to see it. If you enjoyed this video then please like it and make sure you check out my breakdown of everything we know so far about Russian Doll Season 2 which will be linked at the end. This is a channel for people who are heavy into horror so if that's the kind of thing you like hit subscribe. Thanks again for taking the time to watch this, I've been Definition, you've been the best and I'll see you next time. Take care, peace.